All right, we've just been punching out about an hour to get out to this first spot. We're sitting in about 100 foot of water, trying to work out which way we're going to drift. But yeah, I'm going to try a 60 gram jig to start with. This is an Ocean's Legacy Slow Element P3. I prefer to use a little P3 uh, on all my inshore sort of stuff because it's uh, just a bit better with the light of jigs, a bit of a softer tip, but still has plenty of balls for these fish. Um, 1500 Ocean Jigger, it's a high gear P3 Sunline Siglon, which is uh, 50 pounds, so plenty of stopping power there. All right, we found a few fish here. Um, just gonna set this drift up. And I'm using what they call a sea anchor or a drogue or whatever you wanna call it. Um, see a lot of people using electrics out here, but what that does is when you spot lock, you spot lock to a GPS location, whereas this basically anchors you to the water with the current, so it allows you to use a smaller jig. So. Just chuck that out the back here. Get a bit of water in it to slow us down. And then we're away. Oh yeah. Just a quick tip if you are when you are rigging up your jigs, I see a lot of people tying off to the top of your jig there. It is a lot stronger connection to tie straight to a solid ring and just use your split ring so you can change a jig basically so that makes it really easy like if i work out like that the 60 is not going to hit the bottom and i'm not going to stay over it then i can easily jump up to a 80 gram it won't be cutting any line or anything like that so we'll drop it down and see how we go eh just feathering the spool on the drop just to make sure that jig doesn't flutter to get it down nice and quick we are using a 60 and 120 foot of water so should be um should be right get it down there quick and there we are that sea anchor's holding us beautifully Gonna bump it up to 100 grams because we got a uh, bit more current than I expected. That easy. Slow blood R, 100 gram. grand first drop once I changed. Let's see if we get some bigger ones. Still on good ground here. Yeah, that's what we're working that jig pretty fast then, so just half a handle turn with a little twitch, so Gives them something to chase. Oh, I just missed something then. Whoop. Yeah. Oh. I know I'm in it. I was guess and say that that's all bait down there. Yep. Another trout, eh?
Yeah, another nice trout. Like he's all puffed out as well. Look at him shitting all over me. Cheers, mate. Take three. Oh my god, I just got crunched. Yeah. Just in the pause. Just as I flipped it out of here. Got a nice feed in the esky, so I'll chuck him back and try and get the target species. Gotcha. I don't know if you can see that, because I can't. <laughs> anyway, wait for that sea anchor to do its job, and we're on. And there's fish there. Worth dropping. Definitely a heap of bait down there. Yeah, it's getting thicker too. Should hook up here. <laughs> That's a good fish. He hit hard. <laughs> wow, that thing's a beast. And try not to let him go. <laughs> that thing's a weapon. Well done. There it is. Quality island trout. Palm slope. Slow black, 100 R. Oops. That's what we're out here for. Nice quality island trout, bar cheek. It's got some really nice colors. Look at that blue in his eyes. Amazing fish. Even better on the barbecue. <laughs> yeah, on the drop. Another nice fish. Wow, what's this one? Ah. <laughs> Trash. That's what I wanted. Yep. Get out there. Come here, mate. Oh, fuck, I hate cobia. This is how you do it. Oh, 
just fucking swinging. Stop, mate. What's your name? What's your name? Slippery dog. Get off. <laughs> What'd you do with that trout? Did you keep him? Yeah, it's a nice Fuck yeah. I, yeah. I will. Hey mate, what's your name? Alright, just pulled up for a last little stop before I have to get to school to pick the kids up. Look at that time. Still about 15 k's to get home. But yeah, can't drive past that. Just got a trout and a cobia double hook up in the last drift so we'll see if we can do something similar here stay tuned look at that ridiculous should be on any second reckon the boys are giving them a touch up Rolling in on second hand ground. Oi. What have we got, mate? Under the boat, go around the nose. <laughs> well, that's going to be me for the day. Mac tuna, what? Disgusting. <laughs> oh shit, that's light leader. What's your tip? Flip the bail. Yuck. Six out of ten. All right, that's us. Well, that's us back at the ramp, and uh, looks like we just made it. All right, if there's anything that you want to ask questions about, about what we've done today, just um, pop them in the comments down below. I'll um, get back to everyone and uh, hopefully give you some more tips and help everyone catch more fish. Peace. End him up. Hang on. Yeah.